Hello everyone, I'm Casper Kuma, and welcome back to the quarry. Now, nothing good ever happens at night, so I'm sure this is going to be horrible. A horrible, horrible time. That is the crustiest sign I've ever seen. Hmm, looks crunchy. So, here we are, stranded in the great American wild with nothing but our wits to guide us. Uh, you might want to save up your power. You're running a little low. ravenous and resort to eating the flesh of the deceased like I saw in that one plane crash movie. Don't even joke about it. What, are we lockpicking? Filet al Jacob. Rich and full body, this rare beefcake may leave an irritating taste lingering on the palate. An acquired taste, some would say. Oh, oh yeah, well. we were trying to get into the store. Well. The general store, I guess. We all Looks split like up, which is a terrible idea. With a packet of loose sausages. Oh my god, I'm almost done, okay? Jesus Christ. And for the record, your analogies are very hurtful. Okay, I'm almost there. One second. Uh, let's just let him do it. Let's see what happens. Yeah, there we go. Ah, there we go. And Viola. Uh, your hair clip, madam. Yeah, you can keep it. It's not too shabby, huh? Uh, <laughs> you're good with your hands. Let's be nice to him. I like him. a man who's good with his hands. Yeah, well, they call me Mr. Magic Fingers. <laughs> you know they do. Okay, so, if I were a beer, where would I be hiding? Probably right there on the shelf. Looks like they're right there. Beep, 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 What beep, are you doing? Beep. Oh, <laughs> uh... It's my beer dar. Although, why would a summer beers? camp have any beer? Huh. How am I just noticing how super lame you are? What? But it, it's my beer dar, dude. Oh, God. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go over here. A beer dar. Really? Wow, the kids really wiped this place out. Mr. H loved his accessories. Gotta sell that merch. Link in the description below. Oh, this is what we need to break into. It was in the tarot card from last time. We can get some <laughs> ammo in here that we can use to defend locked. ourselves, I believe. But how do we get in? Don't know what I was expecting. <laughs> oh. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> oh! Very Jackpot. excited about watermelon. Uh, check out my giant melon. Oh, oh God. See, you just cut a hole in it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. You pour in your vodka. It's party time. You just, you pour the vodka right in it. Yeah, it's the most fun you could have with a hole in a watermelon. Or, well. Then what do you do? Most. Okay, I'm going to leave you two alone and go look for some more party supply. Oh boy. What secrets? What the hell is the jail cell for? What secrets are about? What should we do? Where should we go? This way? What's this? Either we're gonna get locked in here or maybe we can lock something in here, maybe? Maybe. The possibilities are endless when it comes to finding ways to die. Hmm. I don't like it in here. Why does everyone always split up? It's always creepy that way. I hear creaking noises. I don't like it. Is there anything in here? Come on. Show me the way, light. Oh, okay. Big boy's out there. That's not good. Oh, he's so gonna hunt us. What's this? Little pigs? Bears? Bears? That's his life work you're insulting right there. Mr. H, I'm sure he spent a lot of time on this stuff. There's no creepy straight jackets in this trunk. Hmm. This thing is huge. Should I go in here? I hope this doesn't shut. 
Oh, the music got creepy. Should we open it from this side? You. You. You scared me. Well, now that's open. Let's go back this way, though. I feel like there's still stuff over here. What happened here? Why is it so gross looking? Hmm. Anything around the corner? Please let there not be. Okay, we're good. I mean, it's not dark yet, right? What's this? Log renovation plans. Blueprints for the structural repairs on the lodge lodge's chimney column. Judging by the scrawled annotations, this is not something Chris Hackett has the money to action right now. Hmm. Quote too high, look for a cheaper place. Hmm. Why don't- Mr. Hackett, why don't you just move your summer camp to somewhere less creepy where you don't have to worry about people being active during the nighttime or during the wrong season or whatever. There are plenty of lakes out there for you to put this thing in. That door is over there, but let me see if there's anything over here first. I wonder if we can go out there, back out there at any point and get into that safe. I don't know. I don't want to get too close to uh, Jacob because I'm not sure if it'll trigger a cutscene. I wonder where this goes. Everything's locked. <laughs> well, maybe Jacob can open it, yeah. Jacob! Come check this out. Although, I mean, the locks here don't appear to be very sturdy, considering that we can break uh, into basically oh, everything. Oh. Alrighty then. Door, buckle up, because you are about to meet your maker. You gonna pick it open, or you gonna kick it open? Okay, he's picking it. Done. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. Fucking mother of. Good dolly, Miss Molly. I wonder I kept this place locked up. Think he'll be pissed when we raid his stash? Probably. What? He's gonna be pissed about no. this whole ordeal. I mean, he left us stranded here. It's like, um. <clears throat> human rights, or. whatever. Sure. Alright, now let's see what we are working with. Hold that, the door will latch otherwise. Okay, so we should definitely hold it, yeah? Oh, hell yeah. In and out, job done. Boom! I wanna look around. Go for it. Better hold that door for me. Is there a safe in here at all? I mean, we need a code. We haven't found a code anywhere. I feel like that's the only way that we're gonna get into that safe. That's a box. Congratulations. Anything weird in here? Just ice cream. What about this? Dirty bags? Jacob! Check no, this out. No, Jacob, stay what? there. I can't move or else the door will latch. They look like camping supplies. Oh, okay, um... There's tents back at the fire pit, so just... They got scratches let's, in them, though. Go. Torn bags. Torn hiking bags dashed with flecks of dry blood. Oh, and those are like... Hmm, those are camping bags. Did a bear do this? Hmm. The perfect size for us. Although I guess camping bags are one size fits all. That's a gun. Is there any codes in here? Oh, cool. What? What is 7730. it? 7730. There it is. 7730. Oh, cool. And, uh... Oh, 7739. Code. Okay. Perfect. Now we can get in the safe. Oh, God. Don't play with it. Okay. I'm done. <laughs> well, at least we have a gun now. I, I hope it has ammo. Although, I guess we're gonna get some now. So you're, uh, 
<laughs> You're really gonna keep the gun, huh? Yeah. Why is the door From designed bags? like that? That you can't. Okay. Like, uh, well, I am leave it, or else it'll lock. Back the camp. Oh well, I guess he picked it open, so I guess it's not like truly unlocked. Maybe that's why. I see. I see. I see. I see. Hmm. All right. Well, I don't think there's anything else in here. We should just go open that safe up, I suppose. Did we go this way? Oh, okay, it's just a circle. Let's go. Let's go check out that safe. All right. I'm in. Hey, very nice. <laughs> what else is in there? Uh, just some fireworks. Oh, oh, fireworks? Yeah, but I don't think we should. No, 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 Emma. Fireworks. No, Mr. H said to be quiet. Oh. I guess. I mean, I think they can defend us later, yeah, right? You're right. Fireworks. <laughs> hey, 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 hell yeah! I think fireworks. this is the right oh, choice, right? Um, and might I just add, um, fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I found these like tornut bags back there. They were pretty messed up, and I think they might have had blood on them. Oh, oh, stop, stop, stay right there. Nobody <sighs> listens. Nobody oh, listens. Oh, dude, peanut butter butter pops. Dude, peanut butter fucking butter pops. I have no idea what that is. Um What are butter pops? What are butter pops? <laughs> no. What? I can't believe it. Um okay. Um <clears throat> pop pop peanut butter butter pops. What the hell is this? Pop pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. Oh my this god. This is the scariest like the part of the game snack of all time. What are they? Are they like popcorn? What? No, 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 no. They're nothing like popcorn. They're like their own thing, like their own subgenre of food snack. You know what? I haven't had these since I was a kid. You are in for such a treat. Okay, wait. Is there an expiration date on that bag? Um, no, they're still good. Oh my god, they're like twenty years old. Aren't okay, they? look, they predate expiration dates. Blah. Well, you're gonna love them. Well, <clears throat> I saw a wheelbarrow out front, so we can load up all our booty in there. Uh, I'm sorry, what? Booty? Oh, it means like, um, like treasure or buds. <laughs> Is he like five? That. Wheelbarrow? Uh, yeah. Um, okay. Uh, it's like, um, it's like a barrel with wheels. You can put stuff in it and just wheel it around. Oh. I see. <sighs> Ladies first. Mm. Yep. Now what Which about way? the guy out there? This he's still out there, I think. Watching, waiting, ready to pounce. Who are we now? All Dylan, right. Hackett's Quarry Lodge. Inner Sanctum. It's just an office. This is where the magic happens. We haven't had a chance to be <laughs> yeah, let's uh, just make this Nick yet. Sure, just give me a sec to get this going. Or, um... And engage. The girl. I forget what her name is. Podcasts. Caitlin? I think that was her name? Yeah. Was that... All right. London Tipton's one? Um... What do you listen to now? Uh, what's it called, the one that you're listening to right now? Because I feel like he's listening to uh, important things. Bizarre yet bona fide. Why does he listen to only so weird like stuff? like ghosts and stuff? It's like, um, yeah, like the the weird and the wonderful, digging up weird mysteries and discussing if they're, well, bona fide. 
Boner. Bad. Get it? Boner. <laughs> wow. Your wit knows no bounds. So, should we check out what Mr. H keeps in his private den of sin? Uh, I don't know, man. I feel a little weird going through his stuff. Okay, well, I don't. I mean, come on, what kind of dirty secrets is the owner of a summer camp full of impressionable young children gonna have anyway? Oh, boy. <laughs> Not Mr. H, I know. He's cool. Always been cool to me. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We're making terrible decisions everywhere we go. What's that for? Just to talk to him? What's in the drawer? Hey, what's the gun for? Uh, Chris... Mr. H told me it was for, um, bears. Bears? Here? Everyone yeah, keeps yeah. bringing he said up they the don't bears. really come around because he's got the gun. To... Yeah. <laughs> Just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. What if we need it? What if bears crash the party? Let's do serious. What if we need it? Dude, what if we're out partying tonight, out in the woods, and we end up in a sort of most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah. Yeah. What? I mean, think about it. It's Camp is over, and hunting season has just begun. True. What if, what if, okay, bear with me here, what if what's on the menu tonight is us? Well, then I guess we would need to protect ourselves. So we should probably exactly. grab That's that thing. We need the gun mm. for protection. Yeah, not gonna happen. Why? What about for fun? No? Okay. Yep, yep, totally. Well, we know where the gun is if we need it. Oh, we'll be back, I'm sure. Your call, man. All right, let's go in here. Oh wait, is there, any is there anything by the desk? Yes. Everyone looks at this family photo. A younger looking camp leader, Chris Hackett, with his two kids, Caleb and Kaylee. They look happy. They don't look like the two from the Kaylee beginning. Kaylee and Caleb Hackett. I thought they would be, but they don't look Weird like kids, them at all. Huh? No. I like them. Yeah, me, I, me too. Um, they are pretty reclusive, you have to admit. Yeah, why don't we ever get to see them? Hmm. Are they alive? I don't know. What's this? That's weird. What's on the other side first, though? Let's see what all this is about. Whoa, look at this old thing. Oh, it's just a phone? Hey, give me your number. I want to try it out. Why? Um... So I can ask you on a date. Uh, so that I can ask you out on a date, uh... Mmm, smooth. I think if I tried a cell phone number on this thing, it would just explode, though. Hello? What? What? Who is it? That's not good. Uh, hello? It's weird, I thought I heard someone. Huh. Maybe you should have asked them out on a date. Damn it, I missed my shot. We're not alarmed about this? We think this is okay. We're okay with this development. All right, suit yourselves. Let's go check out that creepy little cellar. Although I don't know if it'd be better to check out the door first, but whatever. Let's check this out first. Well, hello. What is this? You hear that? Is that a trap door? <laughs> Secret sex dungeon. Guess it goes to the basement. Guess it goes to the basement. Yeah, I guess it goes to the basement. Although, aren't we on the second huh. floor? Or no? So maybe why not. Why would Mr. H have a secret trap door in his office that goes to the basement? Because there's that maybe thing it was in there. Here before this was his office. He's like a million years old. This has always been his office. It's probably for storage. Yeah, or so that he can make a quick getaway when the heat comes down. Uh, okay. Or it's for storage. Go ahead, open it up. Oh boy. Oh All god. Right, well, it looks like a pit of eternal darkness. So, so let's it's shut that sucker. Climb down, take a look. Look, no, you can no, squeeze no. through there. 
You opened it, you climbed down. <laughs> Can we shut it? Uh, but there might be something down there. Uh, let's, 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 let's take a look. You never know. Oh god, this is such a mistake. <laughs> oh god. What's down there? Oh my god, Ryan, you will what? not believe this. What, what, what? It's nothing. I had you go in there for a second, didn't I? No. Now come back up. Just, just shut up. It is uh, pretty spooky down here, though, and it smells very unnatural, so... Yeah, okay, I'm coming back up. Yep, time to go. No, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, God, that's gonna bite us in the ass later, isn't it? Ooh, that's a nice chair. I could get used to this. You better hope Mr. H doesn't catch you taking his baby out for a joyride. <laughs> I sure hope we don't have to climb the thing. Ring ring. Ring a ding a ding. Oh, sorry, bud. I gotta take this one second. Hello, Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. What can I do for you on this darn tootin' doozy of a day? Is that your impression of Mr. H? Uh, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, I, you're absolutely right. He does need to be nicer to Dylan. And, uh, what's that? You want him to give Dylan his phone number? That's a little forward, but I can see what I can do. Smooth. Kearney and Max oh. Friendly. Aren't those the guys oh, that were yeah, supposed those to come? Are the ones yeah. that never showed up. Because they're yeah, dead. Yeah, it's because of these goobers that we had to work extra shifts this summer. Counselor's ledger. A list of counselor names and personal details and their tasks at camp. Two names are crossed out. Laura Kearney and Max Brindley. Why didn't they show up? Because they're dead. They're dead. And aren't they? Well, at least one of them. Isn't one of them in the basement? Hmm. Alright, let's check out this door. It's been calling for us. Yo, my guy. Toss me the keys. Uh, so you can poke around in Chris's private area? I, I'm sorry, is that something that only you're allowed to do? I mean, we've already investigated already this trap door. <laughs> Come on, what's the harm in looking? It's... You're not a little bit curious i'm not gonna touch anything oh we're gonna touch everything Fine. don't let me regret it i can't promise that but get it nothing but that <laughs> you're using that wrong oh <laughs> huh Man, I am gonna miss this sunlight. Fashion icon. Mr. H knows what he likes. Sure he does. Wow, there's... Yo. Hey, hey, maybe we shouldn't... Ooh. He has a lot of uh, secrets Brian? in this place. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh. These monitors, this is the camp. Huh. Is Mr. H spying on us? No, no. I mean, uh, no, no, he can't be. You really These think just, that? They're all different trails in the woods around camp. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Most of the cameras are pointed away from camp, so it's not like he's spying on the kids, unless they wandered out into the woods. You know, these are just, probably just trail cameras. What are trail cameras? People set them up to catch weird random shit okay yeah like what like uh, bigfoot sightings you know that kind of thing uh he's looking for bigfoot maybe he listens to that podcast i didn't know that mr h was into that kind of stuff 
Shit, maybe he likes that podcast that you listen to. Secret hobby, I guess. Expensive hobby. Yeah, well, I mean, what else are you going to do out here? Yeah, I guess camp probably does get pretty lonely when there's no one else around. Yeah. Okay, but why go through all the trouble of hiding this room through a secret door in the closet? Uh, I mean, it's not exactly secret, No, it's right? secret, like, it's buddy. It's very secret. By stuff. Yeah, that's what a secret is, Brian. <laughs> it, it's weird. It's majorly yeah, weird. I don't disagree with you, but... It, it's It's gotta be something juicy in here. Dylan, okay. it's, it's none of our business. And if you really want to know, you can ask him tomorrow. No, so you don't won't ask be an him about this. Like, at all. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. Hey, man, why do you have right. a secret? There's so many secrets in your room. I, I'm leaving this secret layer. What's up with your have secret fun. surveillance hey, you room and your secret trap secret door? Layer. Don't kill us, please. Let's look at this. Oh, he's got a mic. Maybe he's a streamer. Hello, everyone. This is Mr. H from Hackett's Summer Camp. Coming to you live from my surveillance room. Is there anything interesting on these cams? What was that? Oh, boy -o. Oh, and now it's dead. It's probably nothing. Yeah, probably nothing, right? Yeah, totally. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's. You're not gonna think about how that was a human shape. What's this? Uh. Max. Laura. Why does he have their letters here? What's all this? What does that say? Camera locations. Is there anything... I don't know. Hmm. Very suspicious. Alright. I don't think there's anything out else over here. Let's go. Oh, hallelujah. We got power. Anything to hear in here, though? Bathroom. Whoa, there's some pretty heavy-duty stuff in here. Yeah, you on some maybe drugs? let's not touch that. Have you yeah, there's nothing fun. Can I see myself? Am I alive? I don't know. Nothing else in here, though. Right? No, I don't think so. Okay. What's this? Oh. Oh, it's just about here. Then what's to the left? Oh, is this his bedroom? Bring. Take it, sing some campfire songs. Uh, is there anything in here? Doesn't seem to be... What about over here? Nope. Alright, I think we got it all. Ah, I'm stuck. Okay. Yeah, checked it. Got it. Got it. Alright, let's go. So. Got anything going on when you get back home? School or? Uh, jury's out. Understood. Girlfriend? Uh, not exactly. That sounds iffy. Boyfriend? Reagent. Cool, yeah. Me too. Are the uh, phones <laughs> awkward? Uh, yeah, probably. You want to check? Oh, let's just give him another minute or two, just to be sure. I don't like how their eyes don't always look at each other. They always seem to be kind of not looking at the other person. Like, just a little bit off. It's kind of weird. I don't think there's anything else to do in here, is there? 
Where you check the trap door? Am I supposed to do something else? Check the charging cell phones. Where are they? Oh, here they are. Nice. Full up. Not really. All right, but I'm done though. Hey, Dunzo. All right, cool. Let's go. Thank you. Nick, Hackett Woods. Oh, so, okay, so we do get to be Nick. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. They can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Oh god, they're I out in the woods. I always listen to you during painting class. There's people out here. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. So he's been there enough to see the shortcut. Which way should we go? Hmm. Why don't you choose? What are our options? Shady Glade or Rocky Road? Um, Rocky Road doesn't sound very nice. Let's go Shady Glade. Let's go this way. Rocky Road sounds like a lot of things we can trip oh, on. Okay, never mind. Shady Glade is oh. just as bad. <laughs> oh my god, are you okay? No. I'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we should go on Rocky Road. I'll spot you. Why is there such a drop-off here? Hmm, that way? Or that way? Why are there two options? What's this? This is a weird little trail. Is this a trail? I don't know. I want to find things. Hmm. Don't really see nothing though. What's up with the sky? Why is it fogging? Oh, there's a chest here though. Let's go check out the chest. I thought that tree had scratches on it. I think it's just how it looks. Ranger box. I think. A box in the woods unlocked. Inside it is a change of clothes, bottled water, and supplies. Provisions for a ranger, perhaps? Do these woods even have a ranger? A ranger box. Oh. Like a supply <laughs> cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods. Naked rangers? <laughs> so it would seem. Isn't that Mr. H's clothes? <laughs> So I have a feeling that Mr. H is the thing in the basement. Which makes sense, because if he lo had locked the cellar from outside and he has that trapdoor entrance, then that means he can just climb down there anytime and, I don't know, strip off his clothes and eat some deer, I guess. <laughs> so, um, I heard this joke about artists. It's pretty bad. Oh, yeah? Yeah. You want to hear it? Okay, here it is. Why couldn't the world's fastest painter ever keep a girlfriend? Hmm, why not? Because he always finished in one stroke. <sighs> it's dumb. Sorry, Jacob <laughs> told me about it. Uh, isn't that about golfers? Because of the stroke thing? Yeah, sorry. I don't know. <laughs> Jacob probably heard it from his campers. That makes so much sense. Those kids have filthy minds. <laughs> oh, God. Just a bird. Just a bird. Oh, I'm so sorry. I've just been on a little... Just been a little edgy lately. Um, don't worry. Hey, 
Don't worry about it. It's just the forest playing tricks on you. I used to go camping all the time with my dad, and you think I mean, I guess we should worry though. Stuff, but you just realize it's nature doing its thing. Did you just say thing? Yeah, that was weird. No, that's the forest up to its old tricks again. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been camping. It's pretty nice if you open yourself I up. I mean, to isn't it. this camping? So you have to be open minded to enjoy camping? Haven't you been no, camping this mean, whole summer? There's a lot of stuff you have to overlook. Like basic comfort. You really just have to try it. I could take you some time. If you want. Uh, um, maybe. Let's just make it through tonight first. Yeah. Something's watching us. Something. Did we miss anything from over here, though? There's just so much area to be in. I doubt it. Although, I mean, I guess we wouldn't have seen the hunters catch if we would have just went straight. Ugh, it's getting dark. Don't think there. Oh wait, no, no, no. What's this? What is this? What is it? Let me see. Come on. Let me look at it. Damn it! I'm trying. Walk away and come back. There we go. What is that? Is that a camera? Yeah. Oh, maybe it's, it's for the wildlife cameras. Yeah. Trail cam. Makes sense. It's all coming together. A trail camera hidden in the trees. Security measure, perhaps, or maybe they're tracking something. It's a very dangerous game we're playing here. Okay, but I feel like maybe that's all of it, right? Don't want to walk around this area for forever. Anything in the middle? I don't think so. Okay. Where's... Where were we? That way? Probably. That's where the sun's coming from. Let the light be our guide. Yeah, I got that already. Ugh, we're gonna die out here. Something's watching us. I think we're back near the path again. You tell me you couldn't find pieces of wood anywhere else closer to the camp. Oh, I know where we are. Yeah? Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. Is this where that one camper just died, or is this somewhere else? What does his shirt say? Burning? Didn't. This has a lot of ends. Just... Wow. <laughs> Alright, don't mind me. I'm just gonna take a 20 minute sketch here. Don't worry about me. <laughs> okay. This is awkward. Uh. Do me! Do me. <laughs> that looks so bad. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm just trying to get this down. Right. Oh. Sorry. Dumb idea. I just want to finish this. Take your time. Awkward. <laughs> She's really strange, isn't she? Did you hear that? Huh? What's coming? It's probably nothing. Uh, oh, listen. There's something there. Sounds like an animal. Oh, what the hell is that? It's adorable. Look! A pig? It's so tiny. A boar? <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Oh my god, he's so... Wait, where's the mother? Hold on. Found the mother. Hold on. Save Abby. Save Abby? Save Abby. 
Found the mother. Don't breathe. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Okay. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting them which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Oh, Pick God. The right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. Oh god, I'm not ready for this. <laughs> oh shoot, I'm supposed to hold it? Damn it. I only pressed it, damn. Okay, well I'll remember that for next time. Hold the button. Don't, don't just press it. I'm so used oh, no. to the quick times now. <laughs> Did you draw that? Okay. Did you get all that? Huh? I thought you were gonna draw me getting French by a wild pig. Ah. Got it all up here. <laughs> <laughs> What's slimed? What did the boar lick? Okay, but I'm not gonna have to remember how to do that hold the breath thing better. That did not go well. No escape. So, so I'll grab my How did that fit in that tiny little bag? Guess we should head back. Oh boy. Well, the running mechanic will be the death of us. If it's not the quick time, it will be the running. Caitlin. Yeah, okay, that was her name. Hackett's Quarry Camp Fire Pit. Yeah, let's just waste all of our battery power. Finally get my phone back, and it's just a big dumb brick. Is that light on? Or is that just the sun? I think it's just the sun. Oh? What are we doing? Something weird we can take a photograph of? Don't see anything. No, I don't see anything. I guess we're supposed to take a picture of this? Who are you? Hey, Caitlin. Guess oh. what? Oh, you're back. Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. Yeah. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh, you don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. But, but I mean, it's weird that it's in a hidden no closet room. So, uh, what's going on here? And did here? we forget about the ready? trap door? Um. Oh, so there is a weird light in the treehouse. I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Ryan. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? We're gonna bring her here. That's what's done? wrong with it. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again mm -hmm. after tonight. That's foreboding. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick. Just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. <laughs> it's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. 
We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. The hog of Hackett's quarry. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? <laughs> what? I thought you hated that phrase. Big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. I am brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick-me-up. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was freaking weird as hell. Uh, what is that? Whoa. Special delivery. Oh, is it their fireworks? It better be their fireworks. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell did that gun come uh, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Why? Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, you can't. Cool your They're jets hell expired. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to. Didn't we just say that we weren't gonna play with that gun? Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Not leaving you with a gun. Not a great idea. Not leaving you with a gun. Okay, there is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look. You and me. Old fashioned shootout. First prize. Peanut butter butter pops all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Really? You're gonna play with a gun over a yeah, bag of expired boy. snacks? Yeah, just swing it around, Jacob, why don't you? Give me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. All right. Oh, boy. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. We're all gonna die out here. We're shooting things. We're making loud noises. We're setting off fireworks. They are gonna murder us. Nick. Okay, so... Just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. How no old way. are these guys never supposed even to be? Shoot. Yeah, like it's because you've never shot before. You know, older. That you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you actually- Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes, got it? Okay, good. She got now it I'm gonna together. Now I'm going to some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me or is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, down. okay, thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. So, um, how was your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? Uh, it was okay. It was... it was okay. Hey! a boy! So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's really smart. And yeah. then the boar licked me. Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 no. Hey, look, no sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move. In the woods? Before a real man swoops in. You do that in the woods? Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other no i think he's got brain damage <laughs> okay, watch caitlin just, just hit all the targets uh -uh. you'll have it when i say you'll have it all right huddle up boys this is how we're gonna do this you're shooting the one on the left nick first then jacob's turn keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot you got it got it aye aye all right two things remember the spread remember the recoil 
This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're- Let's see this combat tutorial. I'm sorry to have to say, there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry where you'll have to defend yourself using potentially deadly force. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Oh. Take note, if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread. And injuries may not be mm. fatal. Okay, so oh There's god, I have to let it get close to me. For the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Oh Remember, boy. it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. Hmm. So don't always shoot and let it get really close to, to you. Oh boy. Aiming. Obs. Uh, am I shooting the bottles? Oh, I All missed. Right, Nick, what oh, point? Did I get it? Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. I think you're good. All right, Nick, it's time for real. Okay. Nice. Nice shot. Can I get a twofer? Yeah. I'm lucky. What about this one? Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right, you might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right, just shut up and shoot, Jacob. <laughs> oh, I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Oh, oh you know, just like a cannon blaster. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is how you get someone shot. <laughs> nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey, okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No, he's an idiot. Uh. What, uh, friendly. Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I didn't <laughs> want to say it, but you're both very mean. <laughs> you're an idiot. You pointed a gun at two people. Oh, she gonna just wreck it? Oh, hell yeah. Blam. We thought this was over? What the? Whoa. Holy crap. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. I guess she's getting the butter popped. Okay, Caitlin's the best. <laughs> What's why is the watermelon so ominous? Oh god, it's night. <laughs> this is fine. Hackett's quarry campfire pit, Ryan. We are screwed. Hmm. What are we doing, guys? What are we doing? Okay. <laughs> okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Uh. Come on, people, we might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? <laughs> memories before we all perish. How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? What's Dylan style? Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Yeah. Yes. So we can, like make people kiss if they choose dare yeah as long as everyone consents of course cool beans i mean keep it in your pants until it's your turn but well who does get to go first well it's house deals so abigail oh boy truth or dare um truth 
You really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, I, um, I... That's a no. Uh, uh, interrupt. Hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on. I, I'm not finished. Um, <laughs> have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um... Uh, Abby, oh my god, just pick someone. Okay, okay, um... I don't know. Ugh, oh, ding, 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 too late. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Hmm... Dare. Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Oh boy. Did you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlyn or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry. Hmm. I don't make the rules. I mean, you literally <laughs> just did, but okay. Let's do this. I mean, they're both into him, right? I don't know. Can I also just do nothing? Sometimes that's an option too. I don't know. Let me see what happens if I wait it out. If it'll like... Just stop. Let's just see what happens if I do nothing. No? Is that not an option? I guess not. Um... I mean, they both like him. Uh, I mean, Dylan was kind of coming on strong to him in the office or whatever. He kept asking him if he's dating anyone. And it doesn't seem like Caitlyn's actually made any moves. Sorry about that. My computer just stopped recording for some reason. Have it, please. Woo! <laughs> oh, poor Caitlyn. Although she didn't really make any moves, so you know what? That's on her. Awkward. Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Um, let's make uh, Jacob do something. All right, Jacob, let's see what you're made of. Oh, there. There, man, come on. Okay. I dare you to take a flying leap over that fire pit. <laughs> Naked. Oh. oh, dude! Oh, no. Fuck yes! Oh, I will jump over this thing. I don't care. Oh, he's too happy. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's a good idea. No, wait, no. Save no, your eyes. Jacob. <laughs> Wait, don't do it. Stop. Dude, I say veto. You're gonna fuck yourself up. What? No, come on, man. I got this. Brian, come on. Fine, okay. veto. You know what? Fuck this game. All right. <clears throat> Someone else can go. Okay, fine. Then I call your turn. <clears throat> Whatever. Emma. There. Emma, so you have to kiss. Uh oh. Jacob? Or. Oh. Nick. Uh. Oh, God. Please well, pick um, Jacob. Please pick Jacob. Um, uh, sorry. Nick, this is not uh, there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. Uh, what happened to the whole consent thing? Uh oh. M? Seriously? Oh. Abigail. 
Guys. Oh. Guys! Emma, what the hell? Thank you, Nick. Well, now that we're all unhappy. He's good. That's just terrible. What's wrong with you? Why would you do that? You like kissing my girlfriend, asshole? It was just a game. Hey, I am nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was. It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, grow up. Should have just let well, him jump over the fire naked. Go after him. You should probably go find Abby. So, anybody want to play Parcheesi? <laughs> What? Well, that's nice and awkward. Uh oh. Oh, they are right there. Fuck this. <laughs> They're like, bullshit, this is weird as hell. These kids are weird. <laughs> They're not even worth it. Let's just go home. Pack up your bags. We're gonna find some better prey. Oh great, Welcome this lady. Back. I am, as always, delighted that you're here. Hi. So then, what more has been found? I don't have any cards. Sorry. You return without any more of my cards. Yet you return nonetheless. Why, Why are you even that, here? Do you think? I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. Please, my friend. Oh yeah, I forgot. In the other two games, whoever's talking to this lady is the murderer, right? Secrets or the weirdo? remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again. You can count on that. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. I wonder if this game is actually going to have like weird things that like are really real, or if it's just going to be like one of those it was all a dream thing that the dark anthology stuff had. Because the first one was like, oh, it's all real, or whatever, and then the Dark Anthology was all kind of just in your head. But that is chapter two, so let's stop it here. Thank you all for watching. I wish my computer would have hanged out for those, like, last two seconds. I don't know why it just shut off, or, like, uh, the recording stopped. But oh well, so be it. I... I don't... I, I really feel it in my heart that Mr. H might be that thing in the basement, but it was also way skinnier than Mr. H, so I'm not entirely sure about that either, sorry. Mr. H, you're kind of on the bigger side, but that thing looks starved down there. So he's either feeding that thing, or he is that thing. And if Mr. H is naked and running through the woods, that would make sense of why those little um, chests or whatever are filled with his clothes. Because, I mean, it looked like it had the same patches that he had, but I think he's the only, like, guy that wears the scout uniform around, so I feel like it has to be his. But I guess we'll find out more next time, which seems to be, like, when things will start to happen, because it is dark and they are here. It can't be much longer before we all start to die. Hopefully I'll get a handle on that holding the breath mechanic. But anyway, thank you all for watching. This is Casper Kuma. Over and out. Bye.